Hi everyone, it's Daniela and welcome back to my channel. There's Spike. Yep, he's hanging out here too. Um, happy Autumn Equinox. And I hope that the change of weather is making everybody happy. It sure is me. It's so much cooler like that. It's awesome. So I have my 70% off Jane Davenport haul to share with you. But first, sales. Okay, a couple big ones. The small ones first. Number one, not small ones, they're still big, but you already know, just reminding you about the Crafter's Companion 70% off. Simon says Stamp is having a sale. They're calling it um, Stamp Timber, Stamp Timber. So I'm not, I don't know if they have sales. I, I haven't looked. Also, uh, Scrapbook.com is having their fall clearance and it says 30 to 90% off clearance. Another one I have not checked, but if you like to shop there, then you'll love that. Now, two other things I have to share. One is if you're not on the mailing list not yet yeah, the mailing list the emailing list for if you go to americancrafts.com and you sign up for their newsletter it also lets you sign up it says then do you want ones from our other companies one of which is crate paper and one is bow bunny i got an email like yesterday or so from crate paper about free digital papers and I got one from Bow Bunny today and they have exclusive prints and I'm seeing they look like um one almost looks like black and white vintage 12 it's beautiful one is some um roosters with like blue plumes and another one I can't really tell so there's those downloads there and for those of you who have not been able to get a Conic Mystery Die Set bundle. They're up right now. And I'm going to refresh it and double, triple, quadruple check this. They are up. Their midweek sales are up as we speak. $25 for the Tonic Studios Mystery Die Set bundle worth $100. The other special here is Tonic's Newborn Baby Bundle. Looks like three dies and something else. It's $12.58. And then they have a wedding die set bundle. Looks like there's four dies, $9.58. And then they have that glue. I got that last time because I'm on a quest for good glue. So hurry up if you really want one of those bags. I know so many of you have said, oh no, we missed out. It was gone by the time we got there. Now you should be able to get one. Okay, so where are we? What am I doing? Okay, this, Jane Davenport. Listen, first I wanna say, I know I have promised doing a mixed media video and I swear I will. I just, I'm sorry, there's just too many things going on where I do my work, crafting, it's just a whole mess and I can't possibly show you how to do things that are mixed media without having room to do them. So with the holidays coming and everything, I don't know, I'll do my best, but I think I might have to just regular craft until I can really take a breath. But it doesn't mean we can't still maybe play with certain things or whatever. So I got some fun, fun, fun things from the Jane Davenport. 70% off the sale was, if you recall. I have my receipt here so I can tell you how much that cost. Um, I splurged on one type of something but I, I'll explain. So to start with, I got some new spray bottles and some fine line applicators. I love fine liners and 
you put ink in it and then you write in your background. You know, doing mixed media isn't that hard. My whole thing was going to be mixed media for beginners use what you have. Bubble wrap is a mixed media stamp. It's awesome. A fine liner, a pen, just writing in the background and painting over its stencils if you don't have a stencil. Any of the plastic that comes with like stamps, the carrier sheet or whatever, make one. Just punch some holes in it. You're done. You can do all of this without having to spend a penny on anything snazzy and fancy. It's all about the process and about having fun and enjoying and loving what you're doing. And getting this stuff, I had an idea and I think it did, it's not going to work. It will work eventually. And who knows, I might just get that up in a minute and say, you know what, I'm doing it now. Who knows? I just don't want anybody to be disappointed. So I got those and then I got these stencils and um yes and it also comes with a canvas an artboard canvas so this one is cool because it's a uh, I try opening stuff and dance and stuff see the uh, weather's changing and so is the light it's got texture it's canvas and these stencils Um, I could show you in the stencil. I'm trying to show you on the page. What am I doing? Yikes. Okay. So, this one, I think you can see, makes, like, the body pretty rose. Or this way, whichever. This is front. And this one... makes hair as if we need help making hair come on here's my favorite so that one you can make this ginormous girl if you want and this is really cool because it's a face here eyes eyelashes I think they're more eyelashes lips eyebrows nose mouth you can make like a whole face and then even though I personally love making hair, then you can just put the hair right over it and you made a whole person and then you get to play and color and splatter and do all sorts of fun, fun things. So yeah, I got this and where is it? $5.20. I thought that, that was an excellent price. Excellent, excellent. And this is what I had bought with the idea of, now this is, I'm so delighted. This was only $4.80. Are you kidding me? So what it is, is it's something for you to use to practice making faces. I came, I saw, I contoured. <laughs> uh, 18 face charts on mixed media paper. And here, I'm not going to read it now, whatever, but giving you some ideas about, you know, how to go about contouring and all of that kind of stuff. You've got the makeup artist approach, the mixed media artist approach. Anyway, so all of these pages are on mixed media paper. And I thought it would be awesome to play with, with different stuff. I have a lot of Jane Davenport things. That could be all of us. Um, I have her aqua pastels, her regular pastels, her inks her I'm trying to look around like I have oh her paints I have I love her stuff so that's that now I got these were only they were under five dollars I'm trying to see if I can 
find, yeah, here they are. No, they were $5. This is Glit C, Glitzy, <laughs> because they're sparkle markers. So I thought these, I wish they had more sets. They only had the one. And um, I don't exactly know what a sparkle marker is, but it looks super fun if you ask me. That's, this one was falling out. I say we try it. I have a piece of Eh, there it is. Ooh. Um, not sure if it's mixed media or watercolor paper. Look, we don't even have to, or do I have to squish it? Yeah, squish it a little. It's so pretty and very bright and glittery. Awesome. Oh, the ball in it. Mm -hmm. I didn't read it. I was just, I couldn't help myself. I just had to jump in. <laughs> so, yeah, I had to get those. Super fun. They seem fun. They look fun. Got those. Watch the paper. Okay, I got three of the inks. They had a billion of them. These were like four dollars and twenty-five cents. I had to refrain. I have a lot of ink. Not Jane Davenport, but I have Crafter's Companion. I have Art C. I have uh, Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. I have. It goes on and on. I love ink. Ink is great because you can just dip your paintbrush in it and use it like watercolor. You can. Um, oh, ink splatter is amazing and I love that. You can put it in your fine liner and write with it. It's super awesome, super fun. And, um, you know, I, I didn't want to waste all of the little bit of money I had put aside for a special occasion. Uh, this is Fairy Floss the color. How could I not get fairy floss, right? And as you can see, it's a thin ink and incredible ink. This doesn't really say much else and I am not going to open it. Use incredible ink as is or dilute with water for very effects. Use straight from the bottle or fill Jane's ink, brush, dauber, Mr. Refine Liner bottle. Huh, like I said, use in the incredible fountain pen. Use to refill your mermaid markers. And that's it, don't store in direct sunlight. So oh, that's awesome. Ink is so much fun. It's one of my favorite things. Okay, got some inks happening here. And then got some, I'm not going to open these just because, you know, I don't want to make a huge mess, but these are all um, permanent waterproof brush pens, and it's hard to find waterproof permanent ink, like, you know, like in this kind of a pen, so I got the Golden Age, I got the Silver Screen, they're both glitter, and then I just got the black matte and the made in this suede uh, is the color. I, I assume that's brown. So I got that. So I got those markers. And then I got these are the two things I splurged on. They are her um, drama sticks. The ocean eyes is the color of this one. And this one is Warm Heart. So it's like cool and warm colors. Smudging pencils. Crayons with sharpener. So these have the nice turquoise and blue and purples. I think that's a black and that's a white. And then these are all the warm colors. Like skin tones and some pinks and orange. And I'm not sure if that's a purple or a gray. And these are usually $25. Yeah, you can get a coupon. But... You'd have to get one at a time, whatever, you know. And here they were $10 each, and so I got them. 
and uh, look, it also comes with like something you can color. And this is so you can write down all, make a swatch sheet. So these are all the pajama sticks and like has its own sharpener. And like I said, yes, it's like a black, white, purples into blues. And like I said, I don't want to be <laughs> come out, come out. Can I help? I get mad and just flip it over and it'll come out in a second. Or I can dial it down. Don't act like a crazy person. Oops. Let's pop it out. There you go. See? And we'll just. That's okay. Just the box. So, yes, drama sticks. So creamy. Oh my goodness. So creamy. Oh my gosh. That is just delightful. And now you can use your finger, you can use a sponge, you can use whatever, and you can smudge it. It's hard to do cock, you know, crooked here. And there we go. Those are really nice for using for, you know, eyeshadows or any kind of smudge is so cool. I love it. So, this is this palette, but there was something else I wanted to say and have forgotten. What the heck was it? Let me see the other <laughs> box. Uh, does it say... Add a little messy drama to your artwork with Jane's Smudgeable Waterproof. That's what I was looking for. They're waterproof. Um, their smooth oil paint-like smudgeability is slow setting for maximum creative options. So good. So good. And it's a different girl that'll pop out too and be another um, swatch thing. Not going to take these guys out, but yes, these are neutrals and some reds and pinks. And so, yeah, I was excited to get these. Super duper excited to get them because normally stuff like this, you know, a lot of times I've been seeing in my lifetime. I don't know if it's a lot, but Tuesday mornings had a lot of Jane Davenport stuff and I um, was lucky enough to find some and then I saw people were getting some recently and you know I wasn't, I wish I could have gotten to Tuesday morning, but at the same time you know it was, I have a lot of Jane Davenport but these I didn't have, and I had wanted them a long time ago. I don't remember where, when, or why, but I know I did. And when I saw them for such a good price, well, I knew it was best time to finally, you know, get it. So I did, I got those. Now, what do I got left? Only a couple things. One is oh it's funny all of the squid ink um pads were on sale but i had already bought them all at tuesday morning i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten from tuesday morning and they didn't have black and i even went in here to see am i sure that you know there isn't another color i'm missing and not but i didn't have black and these are hybrid inks, which is um, acid-free and archival waterproof, alcohol marker friendly, once dry, fray, fade, and um, something resist, okay, heat set on 
gloss, fabric, wood, you know, so it works. It's It'll turn into being permanent, but it starts off as you can use it to do lots of effects. And I got these Poppy Girl. I was so excited to find her because I really had wanted her a different time. Now I can't find how much I paid for her. I thought she was over here. Mm -hmm. Poppy Girl, $4.50. Oh, did I tell you that this pad was only $4.80? I should have bought two. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, and then I got this one with these four faces was $3. And this one I think was also... I can't see. The pens were $3.60. And I got these two over here. These two. I just like poppies and I thought she was pretty. And like I said, I love making hair. So when I just have the faces, I don't mind. Because I like to make the hair. Okay, and these are the last two things, and these are also the Squid Ink Hybrid Inks in gold and silver. And they come with this applicator, and this is a blank sponge, and you put it on there. It had, oh, maybe it's on the back here, a dynamic, all-surface, fast-drying metallic ink made with the hybrids formula. Remove blank ink pad and inker bottle. Shake inker bottle vigorously to ensure proper ink flow. Apply a small amount of ink to blank ink pad. Rub into pad in a circular motion, covering the pad surface. Store it upside down. There you go. For longer lasting results, store ink pads in a sealable plastic bag. Oh, so I got them. And that is my... Jane Davenport, mixed media, 70% off sale haul. And I think, I think I did, I, I think the sale was insane. I had gone to the clearance afterwards and I was like, oh, maybe they still have whatever. And what was it? The stencil, this one, I own that, that stencil, uh, five dollars and twenty cents they wanted 12.95 and it was like the next day it was like bananas i was like whoa so i don't know i hope you enjoyed this remember run don't walk if you want that tonic studios um wednesday that's how they say it it's up already um 25 deal for hundred dollars worth of dyes that's what they say it'll be not what i got last week but what i showed what i got it'll be like kind of the same and it was a really good deal definitely a good deal and if you love craft uh, scrapbook.com their big sale simon says stamp crafters companion 70 percent off i think and the downloads from american crafts all of that. So that's it. <laughs> so, okay. I will be back soon. I unfortunately have more things that I bought. I got my Sizzix order in today from the sale they were having. Um, I will be having another Spellbinders that I bought in their five, no, one, two, three, four, five sale. That was only the other day. And um, that's it for the moment. I have to finish No Paper Left Behind. And we'll make stuff because I got this other haul that I'm excited. So anyway, thank you all so much for watching. You know you're awesome because you're here. And I thank you all so much, so very much for being so kind and so supportive of my channel and always making me smile, and I will see you all in the next video, so stay awesome, everyone. Bye!